Hello and welcome back to Aquapono. I wanted to um, give you guys a quick tour of um, progress here in my backyard showroom, laboratory, whatever. And uh, things are going very well. Uh, first thing that uh, we're going across right here are container. This is a container garden and it's all fed by uh, a timer. And so this goes on for about 15 minutes a day. And then there's a drip system that uh, feeds 80 buckets here uh, for about 15 minutes a day. And that's plenty of water for them. We have uh, composting worms that live actually inside of the compost and are contributing to fertilizing and de you know, decomposition there. So keeping the soil nice and healthy. Um, we've raised uh, probably about eight crops um, in the last year uh, here. A uh, variety of things, uh, strawberries, basil, we have tomatoes. Um, you know, we had greens, we have parsley, um, and a whole variety of things. So, so the container garden kind of continues on down um, through the yard. Um, this that we're looking at right now is actually the first prototype of my $99 aquaponics system. Uh, this is available on eBay and they are $99. Uh, you know, tremendous growth off of these things. You put um, six or seven feeder goldfish in there uh, to pro provide uh, the nitrogen, well, to provide the ammonia for the nitrogen and uh, the rest of it is up to nature. Um, 99 bucks, uh, it comes as a knockdown kit these are the kits right over here and you can see it's just a bunch of parts and it has a DVD inside of here uh, that gives you instructions on how to assemble the aquaponics system. Very simple to run. And we have about a hundred of them worldwide right now thanks to eBay and other people uh, purchasing on Facebook and other places. Um, what I want to show you here were kind of our sort of what we call state-of-the-art aquaponic systems right here. Um, this is a 160-gallon fish tank with three 90-gallon grow beds. Um, it's all supported on a reinforced um, platform uh, using a concrete block as the supports. It's all faced in cedar and we've integrated a sunshade device. Now in Hawaii we use 50% uh, sunshade is um, what you should be using and so that's what we have there and typically we have a bird netting that's wrapped around this it's not the most attractive thing but it sure keeps the big doves out um, this is a smaller system here this is kind of our intermediate system it has a four by six grow bed and a 110 gallon fish tank um, it uses a pump that uh, consumes about 50 watts. So it's a very efficient system. Um, in here we have perpetual spinach and the way this works is you actually harvest the leaves from the perimeter and uh, new growth will come from the center and continue to give off leaves. These plants are over two months old and continue to give us tender greens every day. Um, right here uh, this is all lettuce that's coming up. This is manoa lettuce. It's a butter lettuce that's uh, very popular in Hawaii here. These are pepper. Now these were all started from just sprinkling seed right directly onto the grow bed. Um, I do sprinkle a little water to get them down into the crevices, but um, they're basically coming right out of the grow bed. So there's no need to do any kind of you know, worm casting, uh, soil caps, or anything like that. You don't need to start your plants. You start your plants inside of the grow beds. It's very simple the way we do it at Aquapono. You can see over here, the little guys over there, those are basically little basil, Thai basil plants um, that have come off of this, um, this Thai basil plant right over here. We also have a uh, Japanese cucumber. Look at, look at this Japanese cucumber. Now this is aquaponic. This is not grown in the soil. This is aquaponic. Delicious. Very, very good. And what we're doing also is actually starting new plants right where the existing ones are. So I just popped a few seeds in here a couple weeks ago. 
and this guy is starting so as this plant starts to die the new one will be coming right back in so it's very very efficient we actually have um, koi fish that are living in here they're a little shy but they're back there koi live about 70 years versus tilapia at about three years um, you typically don't eat um, the koi um, so they're basically for people who want to um, have an aquaponic system but not have to eat their fish um, this is another little system right over here this has a 75 gallon fish tank and a 90 gallon grow bed and also has a shade structure uh, integrated into it and this is kind of our starter uh, aquaponic setup that we have here this is the aquapono 1.0 this one in the middle is the 2.5 and the 3.0 is the one that we looked at first so anyway this is it this is the backyard we're doing great and please give me a call at 808-342-7443 or you can visit our website at aquapono.com. Thanks for watching.